Mm, I don't know. This looks kind of good for what I feel like this. I'm a over. I overruled. I overruled the computer on this. <laughs> There's some things where it's just like you know, people at my level, I like, can't like punish the you know, like even though this pawn move, maybe this isn't. Okay, king's pawn. So yeah, Sicilian is my strongest opening. It's what I've played the most. So this is a closed Sicilian. Um, okay, this is kind of, I don't know if you'd call this like sort of Vienna setup or like what, but uh, yeah, this is a good move. Um, it feels early though. Maybe, oh, maybe I can exploit it. I guess night out. Well, let's, let's play it. Let's, let's keep the, I'll, I need to work on my speed. Uh, so if they attack here, can you guys tell me why I can't back up? Because there is a concrete reason. If I back up, I get trapped because here I back up, they go here, I go here. Oh, actually, wait, I, maybe I don't get trapped because they if I, I can take. OK, I lied. Sorry. But that, uh, that is a very common trap where you have to be careful when this pawn is here because of uh, stuff like I just drew with the arrows. So yeah, this knight's coming in. See, so yeah, I mean, I think they should do this probably. Um, yeah. Oh no, they can, can they do this? Okay, let's put it to the test. We'll, we'll, we'll do it for the, for the stream. <laughs> uh, I think it doesn't quite work here. Cause yeah, here, oh no, it does. Dang. Wow. I, out, I, I outplayed myself or I, uh, yeah, I got too fancy. Cause so yeah, when they take, I take, or sorry, they go here, I take, and then when they capture, uh, it's with the pawn chain. So that was super silly of me. I mean, I, I literally warned you guys about it and then I just did it anyways. So, <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I, I thought I had calculated it better. So I guess I still got to do more, more puzzles. I will say, I think that's a, a trend in general of when I haven't been playing for a while. Uh, sorry, let me think about this. I think push looks good. I think push looks good and then like queen can come in here with pressure. Um, yeah, when I start to get back into things and doing puzzles again, uh, I'm just inconsistent. Like I'll start to get better and be able to solve hard puzzles here and there, but I'll also like kind of blunder, you know, middle strength stuff. Um, so yeah, I wonder, I, I imagine that's a common thing. I don't know if it's, uh, maybe it's just me. I don't know. Um, Okay, I don't really want to take because then I can't go here. But I don't want to let them take. Okay, let's. Oh well. Also, my bishop is still just like chilling. Um. Oh, and if I take, then they take, and this is open. So let's. Uh, all right, let's just go here. So if they take, which way do we recapture? Which way? They don't have a light square bishop, so it's less worrisome on that diagonal um let's capture this way it's close either way i think having the extra shield of this closing off this diagonal is probably a little bit better um they can try to like sneak this open but like i can take and uh yeah i don't know i don't know N neither looks particularly good so <laughs> Yeah, this game is an uphill battle from here. Okay, do I get my queen almost trapped here? No, okay, I'm okay. See, I'm threatening to take, take, take. You guys think I should castle queenside? Hopefully you said no. I think the answer should definitely be no because uh, this is just like way too open. And like, even over here, like the queen, like, I don't know, queen can like, yeah, sneak in over here and stuff. Um, so yeah, I think I'm stuck to this way, but, uh, yeah, that's a good move defending. Also x-ray on the, on the bishop, 
Um, so next moves, Rick's going to come to to here. Oh, also, if they try to do this, I don't necessarily have to take. Like, I can also push and and force there to still be a pawn on the H file. Um, I can't really. Well, I can sort of do that and give up my pawn. Um, they can obviously take because they have like a million guys on the square. <laughs> but um, uh, could also go here. Yeah, let's go here. Pressure the bishop. Okay, I have one thirty. Okay, they have thirty seconds on the clock. Okay, so they're they're making the mistake I usually make, which is uh moving moving a little too slow. So let's try to keep that pressure going on them. Now I'm not gonna go crazy. I'm not gonna like instant move stuff, but um, ooh, I do have an interesting check, and then sort of pressure check. But the knight this knight takes. Um. Okay. Let's go. Oh no, I can't do that because of the bishop. Let's go. All right, let's just move. Um, I think they're just just moving as well. Okay, let's do here and that. So now I have like some open lines for the bishop. Oh, also, actually, they can't take because I because I take. Um, so I could push or I could take. Both are good. Um, take, take, take. Uh, I think. I think probably here and then march the other one is better. Let's do that. Um, push. I don't see what they're doing with this. Um, I'm pretty well defended. Okay, but they're going for the the trade here. I kind of have to trade. Well, I could also wait. Maybe let's go. Their king is pretty vulnerable. Um, I'll let them take. Um, so I could push. Well, also, also have this check. Let's throw in a check here. I'm checking here so that maybe I can push with extra fortitude. Uh, but if I okay, well now if they go here, now I want the open file. I think so. Uh, oh, also, okay, I have a check here. I have 30 seconds, they have 15 seconds. Um, let's just check this rook here, maybe. Oh, this is hanging. Okay, I can check. Um, uh, I can't do that because of the bishop. Okay, let's go here. So yeah, they have pretty big problems. I can... Oh yeah, this, this was a good move. I needed to... Uh, Okay, they're threatening here, but um, they're almost mated. Wait, check. They go here. I can't check them because of the knight. Okay, I can. Oh, I can just take the knight. Okay. Well, I don't know if this was the best, but they're still almost. Oh, wait, I could have. Oh, no, that's not mate. Okay. Um, okay, they can't take because they get mated. Woo! All right. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a fun one. All right. All right, guys, stop right there. I know some of you skip the analysis part of these videos, and that's fine. I don't care. I don't mind. But today, I would actually recommend that you stick around. Um, towards like the second two thirds or so of this analysis section, I get to some really good points that are uh, very educational uh, that I enjoyed that I think you would also get a lot out of. So stick around. Also, while you're at it, might as well drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification bell, all that stuff. Uh, it means a lot to me. And now let's dive in to the analysis. Um, let's take a look. So Sicilian. Um, yeah, the normal move here, or the main line is the open Sicilian where we trade, but they played um, closed Sicilian. Um, I pretty much do like a pretty similar setup. Um, yeah, so this move order, this move is kind of unusual. I don't know, maybe that's a like main move. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not super familiar. Maybe, let's see, why didn't I jump in right away? Yeah, maybe I should jump in right away. 
Uh, computer says, yeah, 94, 94 E6 are both good, computer says. Um, or sorry, knight d4, I mean, yeah, knight d4. Because, um, yeah, this is very, very uncomfortable. And that's why I said in that other, I think it was the previous game, that often I'll, I'll play at h3 when I know, if, the, if they're going to get this, like, super pin where th there's no way to alleviate the pressure, um, I really, I really hate this. I really hate this as white. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you can see the strength here. I mean, I guess what is white? Oh, I guess white cast. Oh, they can castle to get an extra. Def uh, it's pretty ugly though. I mean, so like if I take, they have to like recapture like this to not lose material. So, um, all right. Anyways. Yeah, I think this, I think this would have been a stronger move, um, right away. Because now, once I let them do this, I I I, I lost my opportunity. So, uh, and this was a blunder by me. Um, I thought I was hot stuff, and I was not. <laughs> I thought I calculated an exception, and it was not. Um, okay, so yeah, here like I want to find you know create some opportunities for this bishop like i might just go here that's fine too but you know i want to start like taking some space in the center of the board uh this side of the board is very open for white so like if i can get this pawn like up and then queen here and then do stuff um you know it could be good so uh and that was the plan so they decided to double my pawns which makes sense uh they finally took and yeah the reason i didn't take here well first of all it, it's the same amount of material so like if they take me and I recapture, like what happened in the game, I get one pawn. Uh, and if I take them first, I only get one pawn as well. So the question is just which position would you prefer? And the problem if I take here and they recapture is now they can just put a, like rook and then queen on the G file. And then like things get scary. This bishop can come in here maybe because of uh, the pin and stuff. Uh, it's very bad news. And like in general, the goal of pawn storms uh, I mean, there's kind of multiple goals, but like one, you're trying to soften up the king's position, like the king's safety. Uh, but number two is like you're trying really maybe the main goal is you're trying to open up a file so the rooks can be active and attack the king. Because like here, if these three pawns like stay here forever, like this rook is just never effective. I mean, it's just always staring at its own pawns, right? There's nowhere you could put that rook that is going to do anything. So you, you need the, the pawns to open up. Okay, so um, I decided to force these two to remain closed. Um, so at least I'm safe on the wing of the board. Okay. Uh, also, guys, if you ever have any questions at any point throughout these games, like, hey, Cody, why didn't you play this? Or, like, why did you choose that move? Um, let me know down in the comments. Always happy to answer questions. Uh, also, commenting helps me with the algorithm. So, you know, don't be shy. Don't be shy. Throw me your questions. Okay. Um... Yeah, this is another, so th this move in general, remember this move, guys, because like th right here, I don't think it's super strong because like they can um, they can prepare this move and trade it fairly quickly. But there are some opposite side castles games where getting the knight here and blockading this pawn is super effective, just super effective. So keep this in the back of your mind as a defensive resource. It can be really clutch in certain in certain positions. Uh, like I could have traded here, but like um, all of a sudden they tra like, where's my queen go now? Like I have to retreat um, like there or there. I feel like I just lose all my initiative, you know, um, like they have, they kind of have the central pawn now. I can't really like, I don't know. I mean, I can go here, but like, I don't know. My, I feel like now the action is kind of should be happening more over here and I don't have a way to access it. And like, I can't really do anything over here. This is all white's um, attack sort of. So um, yeah, I like I like my choice to go knight h5. I could have also maybe done, oh no, I couldn't have done nothing. They just, they just take, yeah, okay. Um, so yeah, they preserve the bishop. Um, putting the rook here is good because of this long-term x-ray. And just in general, rooks belong on open files. So just adhering to chess principles. Um, Yep, nothing more to say there. Uh, here is just time pressure. Uh, really, I'd like to get this rook on the file, but on the open file, but this bishop is defending. So 
um, I was just trying to make moves and apply some time pressure to them. Um, so yeah, here I'm tr just trying to make like decent moves. I'm not trying to find like the perfect move. Like even though I have extra time on my clock, because they're getting low, like I just try to pick up the pace a little bit, but like keep um, keep doing solid moves, you know. And let's see. Oh, did the computer hate this for some reason? Oh no, it says C4 is the best move. Okay. Um, okay, computer does not like there. So what did computer from them wanted Rook HD1? Wow, that's kind of strange to me. Um, so yeah, it hates their move because, so yeah, I played the best move here, takes, takes. Um, and then F5 was also again, wait. It says F5 is the best. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm thinking backwards. F5, okay. Um, that seems kind of crazy to me. I mean, F5, they en passant. This is hanging. Knight takes. Knight takes. What about just... Oh, uh, I guess because like these are kind of... This is kind of hanging, so you can't really... Well, no, yeah, you can just take here, right? What's wrong with this? Knight takes check. Pawn takes. Oh, I guess I have this. Yeah, it says queen b4 check or c, uh, queen c4 or queen b5. Oh, wait, sorry. C4 or queen b5. Mm, I don't know. This looks kind of good for white. I feel like this, I'm going to over, I overruled. I overruled the computer on this. <laughs> There's some things where it's just like, you know, people at my level, I like, can't uh, like punish the, you know, like even though this pawn move, maybe this isn't the best, like. So they're saying knight e5 is the best move here. Um, it's not, oh no, they didn't play that. Knight e5, but then, oh, cause then I can't push. Um, but I don't know, maybe like bishop here, to, uh, yeah, it's complicated. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, computer likes that. Computer did not like that move by them. So yeah, we take. Bishop b4 check, best move. Uh, oh, it's apparently made in 14, guys. Do you see it? I, I don't either, it's, but the computer does, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, check. Made in five, it says. Oh, now it's made in seven. But yeah, I mean, it feels like we have them cornered, but it, like just not quite, you know, like I, I, yeah, even if I check them there, which I can't because of the night, but like, yeah, they're still, they're still a little squirmy here. I don't really know. I don't know that I can, I need like the rook to like somehow come in and I don't know. It's, it seems like I can't really mate them there. So that's why I wanted to like simplify here. Um, and then also like maybe I can infiltrate here now which is what happened in the game. And I have to admit, like, as I picked up the queen and I was like going here, I, I realized like, oh wait, wait, my bishop is hanging. So I didn't even see that, but then I was like, oh wait, it's okay. Cause we can, we could take for the bait, which is what happened in the game, which was a nice finish. So, all right guys, that's it for tonight. I'm signing off. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.